Hello, St. John's. This is Chris Roussel. Today is Monday, August 5th, 2024, and this is your weekly update. Well, Father Ben made the train this morning. He's already in D.C., and now he's waiting for his flight to Paris so that he can go and enjoy the Olympics. I would commend him to your prayers so that he can return to us in safety and health, happiness and holiness, fully renewed and recharged, recharged by such a, an incredible experience. I would also commend to your prayers from our staff, Peggy Haas Howell, our organist, who is currently in the hospital today being evaluated. Uh, does not sound like it's anything serious. I saw her this morning. She's in great spirits, her usually perky and energetic self. Uh, but I did want to pass on and ask for your prayers for her as well. We'll keep you posted. Uh, so things that are coming up. We have Ben's program guide is going out into the mail uh, this afternoon, as a matter of fact. So you might be getting it by the time you see this video or a little bit later this week. It's filled with lots of information about our program year that's upcoming. He, he will mention to you in his writing that uh, we are focusing on prayer in the fall term. And so there's a prayer challenge that you'll have to read about. We'll tell you more about that later. If you have passed by our playground, you can see that it's very near completion. That's really exciting. We are going to do uh, two things on Sunday, August 18th. We're going to do the blessing of the backpacks at the 1030 service. And we are going to do a dedication of the playground. Um, it should be complete by then. And if not, we should be so close to completion that dedication won't be you know, out of the norm. Uh, so mark your calendars for Sunday, August 18th for the blessing of the backpacks and the dedication of our new playground. It's really exciting uh, that things are coming along so quickly. Um, the only other thing I wanted you to put down on your calendar, I mentioned it, well, two things. One thing I wanted you to put down on your calendar is a save the date, that's the parish picnic. That is going to be on September 29th. But prior to that, on Sunday, September 8th, this is the Sunday that is after Labor Day. It's the beginning of our program year. I'm going to be giving an address between the services during the regular adult forum hour that I'm calling the state of the parish. There are some things that are going really, really well here, and I want us to get energized by it. I want you to hear the good news. I also want to talk a little bit about the budgeting process, uh, stewardship. We're, we're, we're doing stewardship a little bit different this year, and I want you to hear about that and understand where we're coming from and what we need from you all in order to have a successful stewardship campaign. Um, this is all good information, good, good news. It's all good news, and I'm really excited to share it with you. I'll have a couple of other speakers on some other topics that will be speaking that day. So that's Sunday, September 8th during the Adult Forum, and that I'm calling the State of the Parish. Different than the annual meeting, uh, <clears throat> but anyway, uh, you'll get the drift. So just be here and be with us. Um, I am so accustomed to being with my buddy Ben and to being able to play off of him that it, it feels almost awkward these days to, to, to do this without him. But uh, he's off. He deserves it. It's a well-deserved break for sure. And I look forward to his return with many, many stories. Be assured of my prayers for you. May God bless you. Know that I love you. And know that if you ever need anything, please call our office. You also should have my cell phone number. You can call me directly uh, if you ever need anything. May God bless you and keep you. God love you, and we'll see you soon.